Hello there, I'm Ross Dunn, tenor horn player. For those of you who saw my masterclass videos last year, I was speaking a little bit about how to practice, uh, along with the, uh, um, the basics of what makes good brass playing and the, se and the seven rudiments or uh, the seven elements of brass playing which were set by Herbert Clark and Claude Gordon in their famous method books. Today though, I shall be uh, speaking about what to practice. So it's very important to have a daily routine um, and, and also to uh, have a library of method books, of, of different method books, so you, so you, so you can vary your, your practice as much as possible. So on to, on to the routine. Now, th now this is a routine that I, that I would practice every day. Firstly, I like to practice pedal notes. Second, high register. Third, repertoire or dynamic practice. Four, slurs and flexibilities. Five, tonguing and interval practice. And six, uh, some of Herbert Clark's technical studies played very softly um, in, in order to keep your lips nice and supple and fresh right at the end of your daily practice. So on to the on to some of the method books that you could use uh, for, 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 for your practice here. So um, when I'm practicing my pedal notes and the high range at the very start of my daily practice, I, I always like to practice from uh, uh, Claw Gordon's systematic approach to daily practice. Um, every lesson in that book uh, stretch, stretches the range down as far as possible into, into the pedal re register and, and up as far as possible into the very high register too. Um, also, it, also this, this book has very good exp explanations by Claude Gordon. A very good book to practice from. So after you um, cover your pedal notes and your high register, then move on to uh, re repertoire or, or, or dynamic practice. If you have no uh, pieces as such to practice, then there are always substitutes for this. So I uh, I sometimes like to play out of uh, Herbert Clark's characteristic studies, which uh, features a series of 24 studies in all keys, which uh, which are, are, are supposed to challenge, uh, but also to be satisfying to play. So the practice of dynamics is also very Im important. Um, band in most places at the moment is off, so it's uh, so so it's always very good to cover uh, the volume of playing that we would um, that we would play in band. So the best book to cover this is Max Schlossberg's Daily Drills and Technical Studies, which features a series of uh, long notes, uh, uh, slurs, scales, tonguing, and interval. Uh, studies which cover a, a, a wide range of of of, di of dynamic practice too. So that's a very good book to pra uh, to, uh, to practice out of. So after the repertoire and and uh, dynamic practice, then we must move on to uh, to the slurs and flexibilities. If you want something basic to practice, then look no further than the first few studies of um, Claude Gordon's daily trumpet routines. Um, featuring simple uh, slurs with the, with with the intervals of a fifth and and then and then stretching it to a, to an octave two. It, but it, but if you want something a, li a little more challenging, then then I would recommend you practice out of Charles Collins' Lip Flexibilities here, um, which which features a, gr a great range of uh, of flexibilities, um, also stretching uh, the range up into the very high register two. Um, there so. Claude, uh, Claude Gordon also wrote a great book on 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 this called Tongue Level Exercises, which uh, which features a great series of slurs and flexibilities too. So after you um, practice your slurs and flexibilities, then obviously move move on to your tonguing and interval practice. Now Claude Gordon wrote the thirty the the velocity studies here, which uh, features tonguing in all ranges, all the way from the pedal register all the way up. Uh, to the very high register too. And for your interval practice now, um, I would uh, I would play out of San uh, out of San Jacome's method every single day. Now the pages that you are looking for in here are pages pages one hundred and fifty seven all the way through to uh, two hundred and six. Uh, feature great uh, uh, feature a, gr a great range of uh, studies uh, uh, to practice your intervals. 
And then finally, at the very end of your practice, um, practice uh, some of Herbert Clark's studies very, very quietly in order to uh, uh, keep the lips nice and supple and fresh at the end of your daily practice routine. So the, t uh, the two books that you can practice this stuff out of um, is the Setting Up Drills by, uh, by Herbert Clark. And then, and then finally, uh, the uh, his most famous book, the the, uh, the technical studies. There, if you want to find out a little more about brass playing, then uh, then look no further than Claude Gordon's final book that that he wrote. Brass playing is no harder than a deep breathing. It's not a practice book as such, but it's more of a textbook uh, covering everything uh, uh, to uh, to do with uh, to, uh, to do with brass playing. So if you need to. Uh, uh, to have any info on brass playing then look no further than brass playing is no harder than deep breathing by claude gordon so that finishes uh, my masterclass for now if you would like uh, uh, to book an online lesson with me or if you would like to order my new cd then please contact my email rostern 98 at gmail.com thank you